Welcome to the Ron Stokes Buckeye Weekly Update, brought to you by WOW Internet Cable and Phone. Hi, I'm in Milwaukee for the first round of the NCAA tournament featuring the Ohio State men's Buckeye team facing UC Santa Barbara tonight at 945. It's going to be a long day for me, Paul Kills and Skip Mossick. I apologize for not having my clips from the men's and women's Big Ten tournament championships. My camera broke, so I have a new one, and hopefully I'll have those images up pretty soon. Uh, first and foremost, I want to congratulate Coach Foster and his women's team for uh, their second consecutive uh, Big Ten tournament championship, and Coach Foster for his sixth straight Big Ten regular season championship. Uh, this team is not finished. There's a lot to be done. Uh, I like their seating. Uh, they have a chance to do some great things. Their first and second game is in Pittsburgh, where should they win those two ball games, they'll head over to Dayton for the regionals. Uh, the men tonight, uh, it's going to be an important game. Uh, as you all know, going dating back to last year, they lost to Sienna in the first round. A lot of those players, including Evan Turner, still remembers that very, very clear clearly. <clears throat> so this is going to be important for them to come back and be uh, ready to play here tonight. Uh, that first game in the NCAA tournament is always the, the big question mark because it's a field thing, getting used to the environment, getting used to the officials. So it's going to be key that this team gets off to a great start. A couple of things that may be uh, of interest. John Diebler is not, uh, not feeling 100%, uh, but he'll, hopefully he'll be uh, ready to go tonight. I'll be back in a moment with some, uh, some clips from the press conference from yesterday. Let's say you wake up in 2010 and there's no gravity. What would you do? You could tether yourself to a tree. You could complain about your floaty hair and the fact that your car is never where you parked it. Or, in the midst of all the chaos, you could be happy that at least one thing hasn't changed. The price of your WOW bundle. Add WOW phone or internet service to your WOW cable and your price is guaranteed until 2011. Because it feels good to know that not everything is going up. The switch is easy. Call WOW today. Okay, I'm back. Uh, the first clip, real quick, this is uh, John Diebler in the locker room and just I was hanging out with the team and I wanted to get his, uh, his mindset when Evan Turner shot and made that great play at the end of the Michigan game, the first game of the Big Ten tournament. And John Diebler was the first guy that ran into Evan Turner's arms and uh, he was just excited. But uh, check out his comment. Hey John, I do want to ask you one question though, man. Uh, what was you, what were you thinking exactly when Evan took that shot? I was hoping he made it. Are you hoping <laughs> and then made? he made it? And I, I like had to look twice. Oh, like, he really didn't make it. That day, man, I started celebrating. I think you were the first guy in his arm, oh, right? Crazy. You were nuts, man. I was like, yes. <laughs> Thank you, Evan Turner, yet again. The next clip is the Ohio State uh, men's basketball team walking out with. Coach Mata and the rest of the staff, and every NCAA tournament they'll have a public practice for each team to come out, and it's a way for the fans and the media to get to know the team a little bit more right before they play the next day. And here's the Ohio State basketball team walking out, and the Ohio State music in the background. 27 wins and seven losses, coached by Dad Mata, the Ohio State Buckeyes. today. Um, I'm going to take me a nap because it's a long day tonight and uh, I'll be back to you soon. Take care. Go Bucks. Thank you for visiting Ron Stokes Buckeye Weekly Update brought to you by WOW Internet Cable and Phone.